Front back cure nothing if not predictable. I bet your advisors paid you to hide Adamos somewhere defensible and undetectable. But you had to show it off, didn't you? As an investor, I must say, I don't approve. Glast? You're the shadow investor? You ingrate. You could have had everything. And now you seek to ruin your mentor's hard work? Your hard work? I didn't design Animo to be a weapon. And I would have never disabled its governor. You always were clever. But you never did have vision. On the contrary, I envision this whole venture will come crashing down around you. Each Geno attack on my Ambulus has been locked, analyzed, and refactored from our Animo project. You've brought these Geno to their deaths. A terrible miscalculation. You've learned nothing from me. I've learned one thing, Beck. Never underestimate the competition. Opportunity. Hack into that ambulance and deploy this protocol. Here comes the dropship with a special delivery. I, I haven't felt this good since they rebuilt my larynx.
for those of you that don't know Skydust Minecraft, this man has literally created the Minecraft community. Hey guys, Skydust, what's up? My last video on Skydust Minecraft. Get away from me! <laughs> <laughs> It's time for me to do a restart, y'all. And if you guys want to come along with me on the restart, then please do. It would be great to have you. Hey, everybody, what's going on? We're back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Adam. I'll see you later. There are a few on the YouTube platform who have had their content creation journey paved with as much controversy as Sky does mine. He was once the second most subscribed game YouTuber with only PewDiePie standing in the way of the top spot. However, Sky Does Minecraft, aka Adam Dahlberg, has descended the YouTube hierarchy over the previous few years, ending up as a creator barely able to pull 50,000 views per year. How could a downfall like this possibly happen to someone who was once considered a king in the gaming genre? Was it the fact that his main game, Minecraft, just slowly dropped in popularity over time? And Minecraft in general was just becoming a dying thing. Or was it something more profound? Such as the derailing of his self-esteem following multiple mental Ow, breakdowns and failed relationships. I just when don't get it. Even I, just, I, I just want my, I want to see my son. I want the rumors to stop. I want the birth to stop. Guys, I can't like hide it anymore. Pretend that it doesn't exist anymore. I'm, I have depression. Like, I have really bad depression. Strap yourselves in, boys. You are going to need a seatbelt for this Everything absolute train wreck of a story that we're about to look into. Worked my way to the top of the board. Our story begins in the late north, when a very unknown to the world, Adam Dahlberg you began a YouTube channel by the name of Jin the Demon on the 20th of January 2008. Adam's intention with this original channel was to begin posting videos on the popular game RuneScape. While the original channel was created in January 2008, the first video wouldn't be uploaded onto the channel until one year four months later in May 2008. When Adam would upload the video title, the quarter lols would cut it. Someone retrieves the fabulous model can I help before you? all the destruction Dude, kicks in. My brother she is can dying. Be refurbished. Yes, bad, smelly, walrus, torn place disease. This video We're turned every, out to become the beginning episode to a series that would later become yes. known as the Winter Lol series. There were two main characters within this series called Tuna Guy and Samuel. I haven't sold any tuna lately. It really sucks right now. Running low on funds. Better call it my brother Sam. These two specific characters were played by Adam's Rooster character, who had the name Sky the Peter Press, which is actually an account that he had made to his sister, and then took over right away today. These early videos, among other videos, would begin to spark Adam's interest in messing around on camera and making silly videos for entertainment purposes. Yo mama, that was how you doing? Sky the Kid would continue to post various comedy videos on the Jim the Demon channel until he began uploading RSMVs, or RuneScape music videos, in June 2009. Sky the Kid then started to brand himself on this original channel as a called RSMV maker and comedian, which is the video style that he began to excel at during his early days on YouTube. Sky went from 182 subscribers in June 2009 to 1,570 subscribers in February 2010. February 2010 also happened to be the same month when Sky would enter a contest hosted by the cinema, challenging creators to submit their funniest RuneScape video. Sky entered this competition with a video titled Extreme Farming, posted on the 6th of February 2010. Sky actually won the competition, which provided him with extra publicity, as you can see from people on his channel congratulating him on the win. This was also a good indication that he was a talented content creator from the beginning, well before he blew up on the platform, which we will get to later. This early channel also provides an insight into who Adam Dahlberg was in the beginning of his YouTube career. His subscribers learned that he was born in 1993 in the Belgium in Seattle. On top of this, his subscribers also learned about his inspirations for beginning content creators. Sky stated that longtime RuneScape content creator Chisel inspired him to start making content and quote, wouldn't have started making videos without him. I started originally making videos of my own because there was a YouTuber in particular and I remember him very well. He went by the name of Chisel. He really inspired me to make videos 
myself. Sky continued to make RuneScape videos throughout 2010 and well into 2011. By the 11th of November 2011, in the Demon, Sky's original RuneScape channel was up to 11,127 subscribers, approximately 2.5 years after originally starting to post content. On top of Sky's impressive subscriber count, there were a few other things that were added to the channel in late 2011 that were integral to the story. Sky stated in the intro section of his channel that he was interested in RuneScape as well as a new game that had recently started to rise in popularity in Minecraft. Looking back, the reason that he had put Minecraft in his interest was because in February 2011, Sky had started a new YouTube channel by the name of Sky by Minecraft. To notify everyone of this new channel, the video was uploaded on Jim the Demon called Sky the Kid's Minecraft Channel, where Sky notified his viewers that he'd been posting daily Minecraft content on an old channel. Looking back, this makes sense because, as we can see, Jim the Demon has five uploads of eight minutes to post, with the low upload quantity correlating with the perfect view of the creation of Sky of Minecraft in 2011, which might have been an indicator that Sky was more interested in posting Minecraft content on his new channel rather than RuneScape on the Jim the Demon channel. Sky began this new Minecraft channel with a video called Sky Does Minecraft Episode 1, which kickstarted Sky's first Minecraft series. Hey guys, welcome to the first episode of Sky Does Minecraft. A lot of people were telling me, hey Sky, he said, uh, do Minecraft himself, and I bought it. Play. Sky's skin combination began as a replica of his notable RuneScape, being the Agile Top Forest. A um, little shout out to Ubuntu for making my back my uh, little shabby kid. This video series helped Sky to polish up his Let's Play entertainment and editing skills to a point where he began to gain subscribers on the channel. By the time Sky had uploaded his 16th episode in the Sky Does Minecraft series in 2011, he was already at 3,300 subscribers. A lot of the channel comments at the time referred to his RuneScape videos, so it's likely that a lot of these subscribers had come over from the Jim the Demon RuneScape channel, which showed that his original RuneScape channel wasn't just a waste of time, it was helping him with the growth of the new channel. As the game itself, Minecraft, began to rise in popularity, the audience on YouTube began to increase with it, and Sky began to ride the wave of the newfound popularity in the game he was making videos on. However, the amount of creators making Minecraft content on YouTube forced Sky to create a gimmick that would eventually differentiate itself from the other creators on the site. Sky began to call Gold Bars Butter in the video More Butter in December 2011. Your house needs salted butter. Take they the butter! This would create a form of inside joke with his fans, her. strengthening the creator-fan relationship further. This video, More Butter, was recorded with his girlfriend and fellow YouTuber you at the time, Dawn, or this. Dawn for short. Sky would go on to get engaged to Dawn at a later Execute date, however the, the relationship would ultimately end before marriage, but we'll get to that in a little bit. Sky continued to post Minecraft from 2011 oh, all the way up until April 2012 when he posted his 100th video, a challenge video attempting all of the viral challenges like the Cinnamon Challenge, the Warhead Challenge, etc. This was Sky Does Minecraft's first IRL video on the channel.